24. Here's meteorologist Tom DeVecchio, your weather authority. Rain this morning and it just keeps coming as we check things out on our U.S. netting weather cam. Uh, we find that uh, the rain showers continuing to fall. Wet conditions here uh, really since 3 o'clock this morning when the first of these lake effect summer variety showers started to fall. They've been uh, falling and at a pretty good clip. Now notice here you can kind of see the circular motion. Uh, it, what's uh, the reason it's hanging around so long, as you might guess? It's not a fast mover. This circulation at 3 o'clock was just coming off the lake. So it has moved, at best, around 30 miles in about nine hours. So that's not a fast mover. And because of that, the rain just hangs around. And you can see uh, we're finally maybe seeing uh, perhaps uh, an ending of the steady rain here. Probably, though, another good hour before that uh, starts reaching the lakeshore. And Warren, out toward uh, Cochranton, Titusville, you pretty much missed most of the main stuff. Uh, but this right here I may finally give you over about a couple hours from now. You may finally get some decent rain out of this as this wave continues to move off toward the south and it has uh, really kept things cool but we are looking at some better weather for the weekend now these waves are always a little tricky so we're going to keep uh, just being the safe side maybe a few showers hanging around tomorrow morning primarily in the eastern mountains but everyone should become partly sunny by the afternoon Erie to Meadville Warren clouds may be hanging tough for much of the day but the fourth looking great Beautiful sunshine, warming temperatures, dry, great weather for fireworks displays. And even if you're watching the fireworks Saturday night, weather should be okay. It might be a little cool, but I doubt we'll see any rain. Uh, rain, cool temperatures, not even 60, okay, except in Cory. Everyone in Erie County uh, at 58, 59 degrees. And until the rain stops, we'll get a little bit of a rebound. I'm thinking maybe mid-60s by late afternoon. But until then, we are chilly. Even Crawford County, 59 in Crossville. Rick has had some steady rain much of the morning. And uh, where the rain has been a little less prominent, Meadville toward West Mead, that's been a little bit milder, uh, 64, 65. In Warren County, uh, Gene, uh, chilly at 55, though he's had most of the rain in Warren County. Saybrook and Youngsville uh, have not seen a lot of rain, and obviously they've responded with some milder temperatures. 72 in Saybrook. Uh, you can see the clouds thickening up, and uh, they even had some sunshine in Saybrook. And uh, we see the clouds a little thinner here uh, over in the northern parts of Lake Erie. So I'm hopeful that maybe by late in the day we'll see some of that sunshine uh, come in here, at least a filtered sun by the end of the day. We're not done with the showers, though. We'll keep the thread in for the evening, but they will be diminishing after midnight. Big question is, what's going to happen tomorrow? Future cast, not bullish, uh, which is good news. Maybe a few leftover showers in the east. Sunshine does come out, Erie the Meadville, by midday into the afternoon. But as you can see, may hang tough uh, with the clouds here in Warren County. But after that, we're setting up for some nice weather for Sunday and summer heat and humidity return on Monday. So periods of rain and maybe some storms here and there, particularly through mid-afternoon. Temperatures, uh, when the rain slows down, should get into the mid-60s. On the inland side, you'll have some periods of showers, possible storms. Your highs also in the mid-60s. And in the Chautauqua Gain area, scattered showers and possible storms developing. Temperatures will be in the middle to upper 60s. Evening showers and then the rain diminishing later tonight. Maybe a few morning showers in the east tomorrow. Otherwise, clouds of sunshine here in Erie. Could stay mostly cloudy until mid to late afternoon in the mountains. But everyone gets some sunshine. Warm on Sunday, lower 80s. And then warm and humid for the beginning of next week. Latest updates 